Korea's beauty boom. Korea has exploded in plastic surgery. Some people say every single person in Korea is interested in getting plastic surgery or they already have had it. We're gonna talk about that full throttle next. Hey doc audience, Korea's beauty boom. Rod, you were editor-in-chief of the world's largest plastic surgery journal, PRS, Plastic Reconstruction Surgery, for 20 years. So you probably know better than anybody how Korea has grown to this incredible popularity in that video. Oh my God, like that's crazy, huh? It is crazy, Bill. Now, Korea is a fascinating <clears throat> place. South Korea, talented plastic surgeons. We get a lot, we obviously publish a lot of articles from there. They are just infatuated with cosmetic surgery from their youth, their tweens, to the K-pops, to the adults. So, you know, we've all been there several times and it's unbelievable. I think per capita, it's probably the number one for plastic surgery in the interest. And their teenagers are getting all these non-surgical cosmetic treatments. And then you can see it on TikTok where all these surgeries are being undertaken. And really it's kind of the extremes of surgery. And, it is just mind blowing what we're seeing and some of these patients are transformed so much that it's hard to believe. And also they have to get new passports when they go back home. <laughs> it's just unbelievable. And some of the offices have passport photo booths after their recovery. And I just think that it's just a little bit over the edge. I mean, that video is over the top, but obviously it's like some TikTok video. So somebody's trying to get a, a rise. That probably right. is not, that's not the norm probably in, in Korea. I actually just met a group of Korean plastic surgeons not uh, too long ago, and they're very normal people. I of mean, course. you know, so I don't think they're, they've got 50 people running around <laughs> fresh after, after surgery. That's who knows what that is. But um, yeah, it's crazy. It's very, very popular. You know, I think, I think for our viewers, the big thing is, know before you go, there are videos of people going over for a weekend and getting five lasers, aggressive skincare, micro needling, all kinds of platelet rich plasma from I don't know where, and then flying home. Probably not a good idea because it's all about post-op care and recovery. And the same with surgery. It may be more cost effective, but if there's a problem, you know, yeah. It's going to be challenging to get your care in the United States. Yeah, well, that's great advice. That's the hyped up beauty boom in Korea. But check out this video on hyped up best beauty device.